Hi, everybody. I just wanted to say hi and say I'm sorry that we didn't do the update yesterday, but I had a funeral service to attend and a day long affair with family and family coming in the day before, so I really couldn't do this for you. So I'm gonna keep this a little on the short side. As I know, Friday afternoons are usually busy for those of you that have been at work. And I'll just step back and you can see I'm wearing just a casual outfit. Just some sandals, just a little crop top and a crochet jacket. I didn't fuss with my hair because I spent the morning at the chiropractor with my face down getting adjusted and then I went and had a massage. So this has kind of gotten all messed up today. So um, I just, this is an everyday on a outfit. Well, I didn't wear this to the chiropractor. I wore a regular shirt. So I'm mixing up a margarita for you today. But this is an Annika margarita. It's my own take on a pomegranate martini. Because I don't particularly like the, the lime mix juice uh, that goes in a usual martini. It just, I've talked about this before, it doesn't really go with me. So what I'm gonna do first, is I'm gonna take a lime that I've already sliced and I'm gonna run around the edge of this glass and then I'm going to take it and rim the glass. Now, that's not salt. I don't like salt on my margarita. I usually drink it plain, but I thought let's put something on there and you can envision. If you like salt, you can do that. Set that aside. It's sugar. And you could do any kind of flavored sugar. I've seen that in bars and restaurants. So what I'm going to do first, I'm going to put the ice in a shaker. Yes, I wash my hands. Fill it right up to the top. Because that's a big glass. So it's one part tequila. I'm using Herodora Silver. I happen to like it. A friend of mine in New York City recommended it years ago and I almost bought three Amigos though. The one that um, George and Randy Gerber, uh, they did together, you see the commercials on TV. And then um, two thirds of the jigger, the big side, the Grand Marnier, and then a full jigger of pomegranate juice. So first, I'm gonna add a Herodora. Just one shot. So you can make this with any kind of fruit mixture that you like. And then chilled pomegranate juice, which I happen to have in the fridge. I buy these, and even though I rarely use them, it's something special that you want to have on hand, like in your cupboard. Like you always want to have anchovies and capers and olives and canned tomato sauce, you know, canned tomatoes and things like that, staples that if you want to whip something up last minute, somebody comes in and you want to make linguine with clam sauce, you have cans of clams and you can always go out and buy some fresh clams in the market and add to it. And then I'm going to add, I'm going to be about two thirds of this because a little jigger just isn't quite enough as far as the flavor of Grand Marnier. You could use triple sec, you could use Cointreau. You use whatever you want, really and a squeeze of lime. Now, you can adjust that too, right? Use as much or as little as you like. And I'm gonna give it a good shake. Cold drinks cold. Hot stuff hot. And then just pour it into the glass. Ooh, perfect. There we are. Now you could pour it over the rocks in the glass and just stir it up if you wanted to, but I like a shake. So here we are, pomegranate mar margarita, Annika's pomegranate margarita. Cheers. Mmm.
Yum. Now, it's quarter after four here. It's almost happy hour. And since I've been instructed to take it easy tonight, guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take it easy and I'm gonna have my drink now. Love you all. Don't forget to subscribe so that you always can watch when something new comes up. And I'm planning on being back Monday. I'm not sure where I'm gonna go. Let's just make some suggestions. But remember, keep it in line with YouTube's rules and regulations. We don't wanna get kicked off, do we? Love you all. Namaste. And don't forget to be kind. Doesn't cost a thing. Have a great weekend.